Hi ladies and gents, welcome to another episode of SCN. On today's show, it's all about the ladies. We're talking about girl power and horsepower. And to end off with, we've got five cars that I would recommend buying between 100 and 250,000 Rand if you want something convertible. Now ladies, shopping for a car is always a daunting experience. And I wanted to give you a couple of pointers, a few little hints and tips to make that shopping experience so much more pleasurable. Now the first one has to be enjoy yourself. When you're going to go out and spend the kind of money that it takes to buy a car these days, I want you to absolutely have fun. Take a few friends with. What I can never understand is how it takes five ladies five hours to spend 500 grand on a handbag, yet it takes one lady 15 minutes to spend 500 grand on a motor car. So I absolutely encourage you to get your friends out there and enjoy the shopping experience. And try some stuff on. When I say try some stuff on, if you found a car you're thinking about wanting to buy, take it for a test drive. Test numerous different cars during the course of the day. I promise you it's all part of the fun, but it'll also give you a pretty good idea as to exactly what kind of car it is you're gonna end up buying. And on that note, you need to do a bit of homework. Before you get into the dealership, I'm hoping you will have spent a day or two understanding firstly, how much money you can afford to spend on a motor car. Secondly, what kind of car you really do need. Not necessarily want, really do need. You might have Aston tastes, but you look, may, may be looking for Astra budget. So be careful about that. And the other thing is, understand from a priority point of view what boxes the car needs to tick first. So if you're looking for a little sleek, sexy two-door, I'm saying go out and buy it. But if you need something a little bit more practical, you need to stick to your guns and make sure that you've got all the priorities ticked when it comes to your purchase of vehicle. Now taking advice on buying a car is always tough. I'm sure your dad's out there, boyfriends, uncles, aunts, everybody's throwing advice at you. But remember with boyfriends, sometimes boyfriends don't necessarily want to see you in the kind of car that you want to see yourself in. Some of these guys can be possessive. So while you're looking for a trendy little convertible, they might be trying to steer you into a little soccer mom car. So don't take too much advice on that front. Take it from me. Now, the last thing in terms of my points is do not rush when buying a car. Once you've found a car that you absolutely love and you're happy that it's going to come in on budget and it's the right kind of car for you and ticks all of those boxes we were talking about, wait before you commit. Spend a day thinking about the car that ultimately you would like to drive and just play a little bit hard to get. Playing a little bit hard to get might just encourage the dealer to knock a few thousand rand off for you. So ladies, don't forget, if you're out there on a Saturday shopping for a car and you need some company, I'm always available. Give me a shout. I'm only too happy to get out there and help you do a deal. And now ladies, my top five girl power purchases. These are the top five cars I would be looking at buying if I was you. No offense to any guys out there who happen to be driving these cars at the moment, but these are the cars I would pick. In fifth place is the Peugeot 206 convertible. Great value for money in a car. It's a hard top, con hard top convertible. They're not bad to maintain. They do hold reasonably good value when they come down and they are just such good fun in the sun. Number four, the Fiat 500 convertible is an iconic motor car. If you can find a well-priced Fiat 500 convertible at under 200,000 Rand, you would have done well. They are around at that kind of money. They are, again, a pleasure to service, pleasure to run, and they just do look absolutely all the money. Audi A3 is my number three. If you can find a nice Audi A3 in automatic, preferably, they are bulletproof. They are great value for money. Not always easy to find at under 200,000 Rand, but in between 190 and 210, 215, you will find a nice example out there with some half decent mileage. My advice is if you can find one, buy it. Number two, the Porsche Boxster. Again, a little bit of a hairdresser's car. No offense to any hairdressers out there. It wasn't a great car in terms of performance, but it's great value for money if you're looking for a little suburban cruiser. They're spectacular, can be bought between 150 and 250,000 Rand. Just make sure you get one with a nice service history. My favorite car in this category of all time, and probably globally the best selling car ever made, in a convertible is the Mazda MX-5. Absolutely bulletproof. Mazda make the best engine on the road in a 1.6 or a 1.8, I've got to tell you, they're great value for money. From 75,000 Rand to 250,000 Rand, there's going to be a Mazda MX-5 to suit your budget. Do yourself a favor, get out there and shop for one of the top five. Now ladies, you've heard all about the top five cars, but let's check out the top five girl power purchases in action.
I'm sure one of those must have caught your eye. Get on to www.surfercars.co.za right now. I guarantee you'll find two or three of those examples for sale. Thanks for watching, ladies, and don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the original video on the links below. Like us on Facebook. Follow us on Twitter. I've been Nick. It's been real. I'll see you soon.